Hey guys, it's Rob Schneider, the Yankee Brick Kicker, with my son Ethan. We're here doing a Lego haul. Um, this is kind of like a, like three Lego hauls in one. Uh, it's been extremely busy. I, like I always say, I run a DJ company, so we're trying to hit our busy season, so I've been tied up a lot. But um, basically what we got going on is a couple weeks ago we did the Toys R Us second uh, Emmett Lego build, so we actually finally were able to go to it because the first one they were like done within like 10 minutes because they didn't have enough parts. So, I guess Toys R Us decided they redo it since they screwed it up. So, me, Ethan, and my daughter, we all built the cars. Of course, they all gave us one set of plans, and the associates didn't realize there was two different builds. So, I had to tell them, hey, don't you guys have the instructions for the other? Oh, no, it's one build. Then they looked at, oh yeah, it is two builds. So, I built the Emmett car. Of course, both kids built the spaceship version of them. So we did that. And then, while I was there, they had uh, some Legos on sale, 30% off. So I know some of these sets are starting to get old, and I haven't seen this one. Which is the helicopter arrest. So I picked this up. I had a couple coupons that I had to use up for Toys R Us, so I ended up paying, I think, like, not even 20 bucks for this. And I'll pick up that. So that will go into the huge pile of about 65 Legos we haven't built yet. Are you sure it's not 95? It's a lot. Then, of course, we did the Last weekend we did the little uh, the Lego Club meeting that we do every month, and um, I don't know where I found it somewhere on a blog online about that you, the price was going up on the cups and bulk cases. I was like, bulk cases? I didn't know there was bulk cases. And you ask the store associates, none of them know about the bulk cases. You gotta ask for the store manager. He's the only one who knows about the bulk cases. So, I ended up picking up a whole case of the the uh, dark grayish blue ones, whatever they call it, because we're trying to build a mock of Tony Stewart's Imagine and the back case. And I need a lot of bricks. So, 100 bucks. I'm not sure how many pieces are in here. I'm going to have to count and see how much it is worth it or not. So, I picked up that. Then, of course, he got his goodie bag with his coupons and stuff, which is 10% uh, off on Lego Superhero Marvels. Yay. Which, of course, comes with all the magazines and stuff like that. So, we did that. So, that was the second thing. And then, of course, this weekend, may the 4th be with you. Star Wars, may the force be with you, may the force be with you, get it? He doesn't care. He's a big, he, he loves Star Wars, he has all the movies, all the Legos here, he's all into that. So all we, of those, almost all no. of them. So, uh, about like 16 that I have to get. Yeah, he has a whole bunch he wants to get. So, I subscribed to Clutch's post. You know, he's ramping about, uh, you know, their sales were not this, not that good this weekend, which he was right, was not that good. Um, so I didn't really buy anything. We did buy this so that we could get at least two or 75 for the minifigures. This actually had, uh, was on sale, plus you got 50 extra VIP points. So we picked this one up, the droid gunship. Maybe that's the bolter droid concept. And of course we got this. So we can get our over our seventy five Legos to get the mini fig because we're only doing mini fig for the weekend. There's the mini fig. Yep, there we go, we got our mini fig. Then they give you a nice poster to Which is a pretty big poster. Yeah, 
we just gotta get frames for all these posters. I don't know if it's this guy. I think he was my... Darth Revan. Yeah, Darth Revan. So. And of course, since I was there, I picked up a litter box of 2x4 bricks, which these are the tan ones because we got, I ordered a whole bunch of desert plates. I got like 30 plus desert plates. So we're doing a huge scene of Tatooine because we got like almost everything that's from there. And I can't wait for the new Luke um, speeder with the um, pub comes out. That'd be pretty cool. So I got that project. Yeah, we got the Jabba the Hutt's dungeon on the bottom. Like, yeah, we got that. I picked it up on Clarence a couple weeks ago. <laughs> so then we also got the Simpson minifigure collection. So we're going to open these up on camera, show you guys them. But I'm going to probably time lapse it so it goes a little bit faster. Cause You were looking for Grandpa the whole entire time, and on my first pull, I got Grandpa. Yeah, so I'm sitting here filling these all out. I wasn't there that long. I don't know, 30 minutes? He says an hour. I think it was 30 minutes. So I, fil I felt them all. I found every single one except for Grandpa. I couldn't find Grandpa. I'm probably sitting there for another 20 minutes trying to find Grandpa. So yeah, it was longer than 30 minutes. So he's like, he just grabs one. Is this Grandpa? I go fill it. I'm like, that feels like Grandpa. We go purchase them. I open that one up. Sure enough, it was Grandpa. So we're going to put, take these, open these up. And we're going to put them together for you guys. So you guys can see what they're all about. Okay guys, we finished building them all. So these are the figures we ended up picking up. We ended up... I swear, I thought I got some of this, but... We ended up getting... We had three extras, so I guess my feeling skills weren't the best. We ended up getting two of Millhouse. And we ended up with two of the cops. And we ended up with two margins. So we're, the two we're missing is Flanders and the other boy. And a Lego drop. Oh well. You dropped Tony Stark's margin. Whoops. They're Legos, you rebuild them. Okay, so we. Didn't do too bad for feeling, so we're missing two of them. So, missing Flanders, which drives me bonkers because I know I saw a whole bunch of them and I thought I had one. But I guess I had a couple of kids that were going through my pile too. Every time I kept making a pile and kids would go over and grab them. I'm like, what the heck? Uh, wish they had sharpening baskets at the uh, Lego store. So, we're missing those two. So, that is our little Lego haul, which is. Much longer than I thought it was going to be. But I don't see anybody still running at the back. You're busy building Legos. So, uh, once again, hopefully, what, what's going, what's coming on TV? Um, a Lego Simpsons show. Yep, we got the TiVo set, so, uh. Don't have to worry about that. Nope, so that should be pretty cool. So we got these. I'm hoping they could fit in my display cases, but I don't know about Marge. Her hair is pretty tall. She might not be able to fit in a display case. But Once again, this is uh, Rob Schneider and Ethan with uh, Yankee Brick Picker, and we'll see you guys at the next haul.